I got a new hitch. This one works great for what it is, but it's big, it's heavy, and I don't use weight distribution or sway control, so I got something new. I'm done living life with the lights out, die with my own doubts. First thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna measure the height from the ground to the top of the ball so I know where to set the new hitch. And it's sitting uh, 22 and three quarter inches. So this is what I ended up getting. It's a way safe 180 dual ball hitch. It's got a two and five sixteenths and a two inch ball on it. I feel, I feel, well it feels unnatural to pull a trailer with an aluminum hitch, but it's super heavy duty. It's rated 2,200 pounds of tongue weight and 14,500 pounds of trailer weight. It's got the two and a half inch shank, so I don't need to use this uh, reducer anymore. And it looks awesome. It does look pretty cool. I bet it's you like can polish it up and make it shine like a mirror. <laughs> It'll match the Airstream. <laughs> yeah, and that's kind of why I went with the aluminum. I was like, well, Airstream's aluminum, so why not? So to adjust the height on this, it has a lock on the side. Let's pull the dust cover off, and you unlock it. Once you unlock it, just pull this out, and then you can move it up or down. If you need a two inch ball, you can just flip it over. And then just set the height wherever you need it. But I want the two and five sixteenths, and then I gotta measure the height of it. I'm just gonna go all the way to the top for now. So I want 22 and three quarter. Right here at the very top, it's it's about 23 and three eighths roughly. And I'm gonna drop it one hole. And we are 22 and a half. I'm just gonna try it there. We just lock it, pull the key out, put the dust cover back on. That's all there is to it. got back from a quick 200 mile trip. So I'm gonna pull this hitch out to see if there's any like unusual wear on it. Because it is aluminum, it's softer than steel. I've not pulled this out yet. I just love how light this is. Yeah, it's, it's crazy awesome. light. Well, it's just a tiny little mark there from being in the receiver. Other than that, that's, that's the only wear I'm seeing on it. I'm not seeing anything else. The ball looks good. Yeah. Winner, winner. Chicken, Chicken dinner. dinner. <laughs> I did pay, I think it was $259 for this hitch. I'll put a link in the description in case you want to get one. I'm not telling anybody to not run weight distribution and not run sway control, but with the truck I have and the trailer that we're towing, it, I, I just don't need it. Every setup is different. Yeah, everybody's got a different situation, different setup, different weights. For me, it just works and it works beautiful. So thanks for watching. Make sure you check down in the description for the links and see you guys next time.